Hello everyone, this is Kanak Mahmud. I'm with another new tutorial for you and today I'm going to show you how to set your gamma right. If you are using Max with V-Ray, then this tutorial is for you. So let's get it started. If you are using Autodesk Max 2012, 10, 11, 13, etc. Then you have two options in customize preferences gamma and LUT correction you have to enable gamma and LUT correction then in gamma you have to set it 2.2 and materials and colors you have to check this effect color sectors and also you have to check uh, effect material sectors and your bitmap files input gamma will be 2.2 and output gamma will be 1 if you set output gamma 1 then remember uh, then remember that you have to set another things here in V-Ray, you have to go to V-Ray color mapping. If you are using exponential, then you have to set gamma 2.2. Sub pixel mapping, if you want, then clamp, clamp out. And if you are using gamma 2.2 in everywhere, oh, uh, and if you are using this setup like uh, input gamma 2.2 and output gamma 1 and then you, when you are using a material from diffuse bitmap just leave use own gamma images own gamma just own gamma that's it and and if you are using um, gamma 2.2 everywhere if your output gamma is 2.2 input gamma is 2.2 and gamma is also 2.2 then you have to set in the exponential you have to check this out like don't affect colors adaptation only you have to check this and other things will be like before i mean a bitmap you have uh, and this time you have to select this one use systems default gamma remember if you are using gamma 2.2 everywhere then you have to to choose when you are importing a um, image into bitmap sector or anywhere you have to select this use system default gamma and if you are using gamma 2.2 everywhere you also have to check this out don't affect colors and adaptation okay uh, now if we go to uh, max 2014 or 15 uh, in here um, preferences gamma allotication see you don't have any chance to change output gamma or input gamma it's uh, defaultly set as 2 by 2 it's mean the 2.2 uh, it's mean the auto setup is 2.2 so in this kind of situation what you have to do and here I'm using VRA 3.0 so in VRA 3.0 and uh, color mapping in color mapping if I choose export gamma is 2.2 and in mood you have to select color mapping only no gamma let me tell you one thing that uh, in V-Ray 3.0 uh, color mapping only no gamma is equal to V-Ray 2.0's We read 2.0s don't affect color sector adaptation only. I mean this one equal to this one. And 
as I told you before for uh, as I told you before for for gamma 2.2 uh, when you are going to import a map or empty fields sorry uh, when you are going to import a image in bitmap you have to choose automatic recommended so this is the auto mode for uh, max 2014 but you can change the output gamma by scripting but i don't think that you have to change it you can use 2.2 as i show you thank you thank you very much